Welcome back to Lesara Summit Kingdom, this new city builder Anno on mountains basically instead of islands. I've already covered several of the different maps and missions, so don't hesitate to check in the video description below if you want to see them all. But today we are going to do the last challenge, Golden Jenny. I've already completed those three, but this one I haven't even tried it yet. So I can't promise you we're gonna win the first time, but I'm quite confident because it is actually the same map as the overpopulation one. And when I did the overpopulation one, I was actually not that far from getting this done too. Because to get this done, uh, you actually need to get 1,200 of balance, right? So your revenues need to be 1,200 higher than your expenses. And yeah, I think we can get there. So let's dive in. This is, as I said, the same map where we have those two lowlands. We have then those two middlelands. There is an avalanche there for one at this point, and there is no highland, right? So it's not a huge one. We're going to focus probably our population over here. We are probably also going to focus our population on the artisans because artisans do give you more money than the lowlanders and the monks. And yeah, I think basically that is it. So let's dive right in. Okay, so here it is a few minutes later. And as you can see, I have placed, you know, the beginning of a town. I have spent most of my treasury. We're still in positive. So that's going to get full pretty soon. We have, you know, the market in the middle. We have the community supplier and we have the donation spot. That's not covering everybody right now. In the future, it shouldn't be too much of a problem. We have also placed an academy so that we can move to research level one. With research level one, we have now access to new things, right? Like new, the honey production, for example, we have access to all of the decorations over here, and we have access to the card post. So with this, I can now start a new base over here, more around the production, right? Starting to give my people tamsa and eggs and also decorations. So, oh, first avalanche already. So it's on that place over there. But yeah, let me do this and I'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, and done. So we have two basic production that have started. First, we have the eggs over here. I'm producing more than needed, but not by that much, to be honest. Uh, we're already using a lot of eggs. I'm going to be able to add more in the future over here. And then the second is uh, Tamsa. Right, we have over here one line of barley fields. Remember, one line is very important because this way they don't need road access. Even if here they do have road access. And on top of it, you know, the sort of range is expanded. This guy over here has the same range as that one. So that then deliver into those two meals to go into the cart post and similarly on a cart post for the eggs and all of this goes into the market. With this, we've already been able to upgrade a couple of these houses, for example, Lowlander as a couple level two and some monks level two. Now, let's make sure that we also uh, unlock a few more houses by giving some of these. Um, can I maybe also think about an ale? This is going to require to produce the ale which is something I actually haven't done much, so we'll make it over here. So for now, I'm gonna pause it, but just want to make sure I have the space. And then I think we will put, is that fitting now? It doesn't fit because of uh, this. Should we still try to do it? Basically what the impact of this will be that it's gonna be harder to reach these guys. Uh, and this one will, we'll have it. Let's try it, let's try it because that would be right in the middle and really uh, touch a lot of my people. So as you can see, that's looking pretty good. Then let's put a couple more of these. Uh, one over here, for example, one there. Uh, we're gonna want one over here. I want also one of these there. And maybe we can put another one like this. Uh, in the future, we'll probably put somewhere here. Then one over here for sure. And then here, I'm thinking this. Would be good okay then at the bottom over here we have one space uh, it's not gonna do much but okay and one space over here too okay all right now they are nicely covered we may also put because mm -hmm, this one is basically useless right like i can actually delete it it's not gonna help that much so i think we're gonna put a bigger one like this one good so now you can see that there's even more that can be upgraded. Let's upgrade them all. We may need more food, but that's not a big problem. Okay. Yeah, here it is. We need more food. Okay. We need more eggs and more food right away. <laughs> so let's go. Let's put one more egg. Uh, I'm going to put it over here. Try to be as efficient as possible. And then similarly there, we're going to do another line next to it. I'm going to actually put more because I want to also do that T thing. And it's a shame we can't put one more there. Yeah, it's just one. Hmm. It's going to be hard to move that road. 
but not impossible. I would waste probably like this is a nice space to put a 3x3 or a 3x2 at least. So I think we're going to leave it like this for now. And that is fine. So these guys are not in range of that one, but that's okay. What we're going to do is just take this out, put these two on this first one. And then that way we can put these guys here. All right, and now we're already producing enough. Perfect. So let's also start this new one, the hell. We don't need that much, so that's hopefully not going to be too hard. But it is definitely a bit more complex production. So we're going to want this barley, the same over here. That's why I made more. And we're going to want a bit of charcoal. Now to make nine, I only need three charcoal. So yeah, definitely I think that's going to be enough to put just... Oh, that would have been good there. Let me see. Maybe over here. Because I can probably put one more egg over there in the future. Then maybe eggs on the other side. But that is pretty nicely in range. So it is an 18, so that's perfectly three. Actually, that works quite well. <laughs> then we're gonna need only three of this uh, one. So here it would work well, but then that would probably block the door. So we're not gonna do this. I think instead we're going to put it. Uh, hmm. Actually, probably here is a good idea because that's in range. Okay. So we only need three, which means if I look at this one, instead of needing 12, I think six will basically be enough. Oh, this is not looking good. Uh, <laughs> maybe I do like this. So that's on road. No need to spend heavily on a road like this. But yeah, I'm thinking we're going to do something like this so we can still put things there and there. Okay, so here it is. Now we're going to need to deliver that one. So let's put me another card post, actually. Hmm. I'm going to put it here for now. You can always move it later if needed. And send to the in, put it on, and now it's working. All right, so we're only consuming 3.8. It shouldn't be a problem to keep this one going for a while and as you can see that is giving me one l over here for these artisans this is giving two to the rolanders and nothing to the monks they are not drinking l but that's all good we're still in positive our people are good would want to move quite soon to also research level two so that we can do the compact yak breeder i think on that one you know the easiest is probably to just put a second monastery anywhere it doesn't really matter because we already have one in range of those people so it's fine right it's this one here but now with the second one it is costing me a lot of monks but it's giving me access to this so then with that we can do the compact breeder so let's go i'm gonna put one here for sure i remember there was enough space oh here it's missing one shame uh here there's enough space so that's already two let's see who's in range of those two i mean everybody seems to be basically in range so that's great one two and then similarly one oh no this one is not in line sorry so these three will need to be more kind of over here that is fine on the other hand we can use these ones or these ones yeah one two and then we just need to deliver this into a compact yak breeder so how can i put it let me see here so i could put another one like this and then a road like this and then two or three like there hmm. one two three yeah i think that's looking good oh our monitor negative because of all of those buildings but shouldn't be too much of a problem to fix it soon so let's go you're going to go to the first one perfectly just in range second and third so now we have a lot of yaks it's great i can delete this one we're back into positive-ish, just barely, but it's also because we're low on Rolanders, so as soon as we get a bit more Rolanders, we'll be fine. So I'm going to put this here, like this. Perfect. Good. So we're back in positive once more. Now, what we want to do is continue to evolve our people, right? So they want another enlightenment. That could be the gong. That's a good one. And uh, these guys, they want uh, another food. So we could go with the cheese or the honey. The good thing with the cheese is you can do textile. 
And then for sure we're gonna want to do the Eustan Sire soon. The Yakres is also giving two, but it's only oh no, it's giving one to these guys and zero. Hmm. Let me see how much does it cost. It's a 50 upkeep. That's quite a lot. But hmm. Could be a good one. It's now again it's we're talking about two. That's a lot. So now if I just give them some honey or some Eustan seal, I can move all of these guys to the next level. So let's do this. Alright, we're gonna do the Houston seals. Um, hmm, that is not a great, I think, over here. So, like this. We're basically going to have probably two more houses there. We need one of these. Hmm, do I use this or do I send it? Yeah, I think we're gonna use this because I think we can put them in range. So let's do this. We send from the copper mine to the carrier post, and then from the carrier post, we send to the Copper Smith, we can put one, two, maybe, hmm, are they in range? Oh, they are not in range yet of this one, but I think if we put a slightly better rod, they will be. Yes, perfect. This one is not, but again, put a slightly better rod, which we probably will have to do anyway in the future. Uh, we are fine. See, that also helped my people. So, all oh, good there. One, two, and from this to here and there, and done. We're now, a couple of these can be upgraded. Great, now we have a problem. Again, we're not making enough now eggs and temper, but that's not a big problem, we can fix that soon. I also need more of these utensils, but again, we can put two more for sure. So let's go, I'm gonna put, uh, hmm. so let's think through this here. I can put that. And I could put a road there. I can put this guy here. Great. Then we can put a gong, by the way. We knew we wanted a gong. So gong, we're gonna want to put it pretty much in the middle of everything. So let's see over here. If I put it, yeah, it's covering pretty nicely, except those three. And with that, we can upgrade again a couple more people. Perfect. I'm gonna not care too much about this one yet. We're gonna see when we fix there. Maybe it's gonna be fixed on its own. But instead, let's fix a bit more these productions. So we're gonna want. Oof, this is not looking good. I'm not loving basically what I did over here. So let's see if I move these ones there instead. Mm hmm. Still not looking great. We'll probably want to fix that in the future into something a bit more efficient. Oh, we're still low on eggs okay that is they they like their eggs they like their eggs so let's put it over here in range okay so that's enough eggs now we need more tea which means we're gonna need another one of this let me quickly think through this i think over here probably goodish one two yeah, that, that's a good one. That's a good one. So one, two, three, and you're in range. Perfect. Okay, so we have enough tea. Now we're missing a couple of lowlanders, but that's fine. We're gonna do that right away. I think we're gonna do a rod here and put some of these there. How is the range of that? It's not that great. So let's put also another this okay so we can upgrade more people we are back into nice positive good good we're gonna need more utensils but that is fine that is over here right like this is in range and this is in range okay that way i don't need a card post right save some space good good we probably hmm, it's fine so let's put more houses over here too now like this for sure. Like, so I'm thinking out loud now. I think we're gonna do something like this. Where I'm gonna put one of these guys and a decoration. Good. No, what did I do? That is not what I wanted to do. <laughs> My bad. So what I wanted to do was put a road here and then the decoration is gonna be a small one, but eh, better than nothing. Over here, we can upgrade even more people and we're again low on food. Now, this is also because I'm only giving two types of food. So I think instead of increasing again, we're going to give a new type of food. We're going to start with the honey. 
uh, this is the wrong one, sorry, here to, oops, good question, maybe here, go straight, okay, so honey is not that hard, right, it's just a building like this, one building, it does better, you know, it produces five in the yellow part, so that's why we're going to put it over here, I think over there, that's uh, fine, one, two, okay, we're going to do something like this with a cart somewhere over here should be fine. Okay, so let's see if that's enough to get us started. Oh, forgot this one. So for honey, and we send to the market. Here it is, perfect. So now you know we don't we have enough eggs and temper because we're giving a third type of food, but we don't have enough honey. So we're just going to add a bit more honey here, here, and hmm. yeah, yeah. Up, up, and up. So now we definitely have enough honey. We can upgrade quite a few of our houses. I see we don't have enough though yak and lowlanders. So let's continue making more of these yaks. I think here there's space for one, which will be in range of these guys. Perfect. And where are we going to deliver then the yak breeder to the top somewhere? I don't really have a choice. I think it needs to be somewhere over here. And now we have enough yak, but we're missing lowlanders. So let's go. Let's put more lowlanders on this side, I think. One, two, three, four. Hmm. Yeah. So that's what needs to happen. We have, do have space for one here. And then we can also put one here with one decoration. Yeah, perfect. Okay, so let's improve slightly the road to make sure we get there. That's going to make us lose a bit of money, but I think it should be worth it. Oh, still now. Okay. Okay, now it is. Good. So we have a lot of dormitories level 3, except this one is missing one enlightenment. It doesn't have the basic guy here. Can I get it? Uh... Yes, perfect. Okay. So, and they're actually not that far from level 4. They need three more enlightenment. That's going to be basically the incense. Uh, otherwise, you know, it's going to be very hard. So I don't know if we're going to get there anytime soon. We'll see. On this side over here, they don't get much. So we may want to but to get them improved, we need four. So that's going to be tough, actually. I think we may move them on this side to be in range of the scholarship and the gong. Versus these guys don't really need to. Actually, we're going to move these guys on the top there. So let's go and I can put even more artisans <laughs> at the bottom there. So one, two, three, and one more. Okay, that's a lot. Now they're missing just, they are not in range of the scholarship. That's crazy. If I use this road there, they should be. Wow, still only one. So if I put them there, they would be. So maybe that's what we're going to do. We're going to move these two there. And these guys, this is going to move here. We're going to move there. And then you two, you move over here. Okay, so now they can be upgraded. And we only have those two that are not in range. Could put one there. It's a small improvement. And actually, we do have a lot of monks, so I don't even know if we need to have this one there. Maybe we just delete it and put one more lowlanders over here because we're quite low on lowlanders. Okay, so to get the lowlanders upgraded, we're going to need probably... One more food and then maybe the textile because the ale is not in range it's not that far though if i do this i think the ale is going to be in range yes you can see now the at least one got some hell so let's do this let's upgrade a couple more and now we said we want to do the cheese and textile right uh, my artisans they're also already in level three now they would want more prosperity that's not gonna be that easy, let's see. But we're also increasing definitely in our money right now, right? We're at 700, so I like it a lot. 
Um, can put also more of these guys here, as we said. Okay, we're not 800. There, we can also fit a few more. Maybe over here, you know, we put a decoration. And then... Put, oof, this is a bit of a waste of space. We're not going to put this decoration there. I think we may put one over here. I think there we're just going to put a small one. Like something like this. This way we have space for two houses. All right, that's a bit better. Market just at the limit. So let's just improve the road. Done. Good. Uh, this is in range. Perfect. Okay. And then as we said, we can put some here. Hmm. Put it over here. That. So I'm just thinking out loud. I would love to be able to put more there. Yeah, it's not great. Not great. I think we're gonna demolish this one and instead put that like here, here, and maybe we put this basic one there and there, and then we have space for one more house. Good. So yeah, I think that's pretty good. Are we? Don't even need to, yeah. Okay, so three don't have access to food. Are they far? No, they're not that far. So let's try. I know it is costing me quite a lot of money in terms of the roads, right? 300 of upkeep for my road, but it does enable to have, you know, only one of these buildings, one of these, one of these, and everything is basically in range. So I think that is a good compromise. I may put a gong there, actually, instead of that one. Let's put a gong. That way, that's going to help many of these, right? You can see, and this one just needs a bit more. But I don't know if that's possible. We may be at the end of the range right now. Right? This, this is completely done. Completely done. Yeah, I don't think we can get that one. So let's move it and put something else instead there. What could be useful over here? Uh, we already have decorations. And we don't really have space for any of these. I think we're just gonna move this one closer and delete this. Okay. So that's pretty good. Oh, I do have also a bit of space at the bottom, by the way. Where I could fit probably. Let's try. These guys, they don't have, they do have access to the gong. So we are the limit, but I think if we do this, it should be fine. At least one. That is not a huge uh, improvement, but okay. So you also move there. You know, we're in the optimization part now of, of that game. So we're going to put probably you know, one of these over here. We can put a big... Oh wait, does these guys have access to the hell? No, they don't want hell. No. What do they want? They want just enlightenment. So not much we can do there. I think mean, that's fine. Let's leave it like this. Okay, so let's continue putting a few more at the top. Uh, I think we're going to do like this. Put that here and there. Let's see. Yeah, this seems to be all in range. Now we're missing some oh, stencils. We're not going to be able to get more. Eggs, we could get more. I could get more cheese though before. Like let's, let's give cheese instead of doing that. So cheese, I think... Hmm, I don't really have a lot of space here. I want to keep it in case we need more of this. So I think we're going to do the cheese on top there. It's not perfect, but it's not bad either. In particular, what's good with doing it here is it's one yak shack to one cheese maker, and then one yak shack to one textile, right? So we can probably be a bit smart in that. Uh, like, if I do something like this, I can have, oh, we don't need probably all like this, sorry. So we can have one. Two, three, four. I think hopefully they will be in range, yeah. They look in range. So let's do that. One, two, 
three and four cheesery. Then we do need obviously one of these. I don't know if I put it here. It's probably not in range. Yeah, <laughs> it was a bit too ambitious there. But over here it is in range. Perfect. So we can send all of the cheese, and I think four cheese makers should probably be enough because not everybody wants cheese. We can upgrade a lot of my people, but before we do this, let me finish, which is I want to also put textile. And as we said, it's again the same, basically four. Uh, we don't really have nice space there though. So, hmm. Sorry, give me a second. Let me try first this already. One, two, and this one, is that in range? Yeah, so it's in range there. So then if I put one and there, that should be fine. But I think two may be enough. So let's start with two and then see if we need more. Okay, so we're giving, see, this is enough actually. The cheese is not enough though. So we may want to get just one more. Fits nicely over here and there. So cheese deliver directly here and then you deliver to the cart. Perfect. So now we can upgrade a lot of my people and hopefully get back into nice money. Okay, so we're at 900 now. 900, oh, we're missing, sorry, some yaks. So let's fix this. So that shouldn't be too hard. We're probably, hmm, should I do it in the bottom there? Maybe, because these guys, how many? Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, I could probably do it over here. Let's go. One, two, and then we do something like this. So let's go. One, two, three, four, and then we need two of the compact yak breeder. One and two. Okay, one, two. Oops, what did I do? I forgot the road. That works better with the road. That's true. Okay, and it is <laughs> just like this. We have won. 1,230. We needed 1,200. We have a lot of population, right? Which makes sense. Like, if you're making a lot of money, it's probably that you have a lot of population. Let's check quickly, you know, if there's some easy also wins we could do. For example, over here, just the decoration would be enough to get that one upgraded. So, can we do this? Perfect. Here it is. So, now we are even higher. Now, they're going to be very hard to get to the next one. This one is only level 2 because it's not getting access to many things. Okay, so we can also fix this. Let's put a gong and a decoration. Oh, he wants some more food. Sorry, I, I missed that. I missed that. We're still winning. I could definitely put a few more houses over here. They want a mandala. So let's put a mandala. It's probably overkill, but anyway, that's... Uh, life like this just a couple more houses yeah uh, one more of these yeah okay i should have put artisans because artisans give more money yeah as you can see actually that was a bad thing now we are a bit lower on money but we still won that's the important thing we still have a bit of space over here we still have space there and we haven't touched this third month uh, fourth mountain sorry there's the avalanche so it's not like you will be able to use it a lot but still i think that was a good one I hope you enjoy also seeing me, uh, you know, doing it live, doing it from start to finish. You see my thought process. Please smash like button. Tell me in the comments also what next you want to see on this game. And I hope to see you next time.